embrace the strange. Today's illusion is star dial. I almost didn't paint this. It's crazy, but in keeping to my affirmation, sort of, of embracing the strange, so I embrace the strangeness of this piece. The figure is bent, standing in its own mouth, so inside its own alien head. It's opened its mouth, splitting its head, its face, mouth, like a suitcase. The five of the six legs are poised in the air while the figure balances on the one. The arms pull the mouth open and grip the teeth for stability. Sensible, since the mouth here is the void or space itself. Bottomless, abysmal, and vacuumy. Like the legs, there are six eyes, two in the figure's torso, four in the figure's head. Green orbs hang in the air. Interestingly, the original concept only had two legs, but in my honoring the strange and sort of giving in to my callings, I actually added the extra legs. That's really my new thing. I don't know why exactly. I think it, it's very, uh, uh, circumstantial, I guess, depending on it. Yeah. I like to think it prevents a stagnant image. I just really don't like that now. I don't know. I don't know how I ever did, like, still things. Maybe it's a frenzy or the work it conveys, the effort behind it, but it's not really that contrived because like I said, like I kind of pictured it, but I was like, this is weird. Why would I ever think of such a thing? The mind is strange. It's like, um, before I was like, I would never, never, you know, now it's like, however, I love this exactly how it is and it's very much how I envisioned it to look like. It is a good contender for my favorite. How do you feel about it? Please share if you uh, feel compelled to. Anyway, if you take anything away from this video, it is art, truly art, and art goes on. So I will in my next video. Thank you for watching.